Howdy, 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 my darlings, Pisces. How are you doing? My name is Simply Valka, and today we're going to get into your weekly tarot reading, Pisces, for June 2022. All right, darling. So if you enjoy this tarot reading here today, be sure to give this video a like and subscribe, Pisces. It's completely free to support me in this way. And join the family if you haven't, darling. Why not? Let me know as well in the comments below, Pisces, how this tarot reading resonates and the way I'll give you a secret here, Pisces, the way to get general readings to really resonate with you from YouTube or wherever you get your uh, tarot readings from, Pisces, is by checking out your sun, moon, rising and Venus sign, because that's how you customize readings into really resonating with your personal life stories doing that. All right. So let's just get right into your reading here, Pisces. Let's see what's going on for you guys at this current point in time. All right. One last bridge shuffle here, and then let's get right into this. All right, we have the Six of Swords coming in, darling, with the Fool Energy. Ooh. And then you guys have the Seven of Cups here. Ooh, y'all are doing some big changes here, Pisces, and I celebrate you for that. Y'all are changing this narrative. Y'all are changing the storyline here. Y'all are doing big changes, Pisces. Come on now. That This makes me really happy. Like, I'm holding these three cards and it has me beaming for you, Pisces, all right? Because you guys are changing your story. You guys don't, like, it's like you look at your current environment and you're just like, you know what? This just is not hitting in the way that it needs to hit. And I I feel like for you Pisces by you changing directions well yes this is going to be uncomfortable for you because naturally you you're you you choosing to change up your trajectory you changing directions here you're leaving your comfort zone you're leaving what it is that you have known but it's like by you doing this that's how you step into this whole new journey for yourself here that is very prosperous all right so Pisces, I feel like for many of you guys, you've been having just like this uh, desire where you're just like, you know what? I just want to pack my bags and just like move to a whole new place. All right. When it comes to just like your living situation, when it comes to a job, you're like, you're like sitting there in your car in the parking lot and you're just like, I don't know if I want to do this for the rest of my life. Yeah, right. Like you just want to not, you just want to turn the car back on and just drive back home and look, do something else entirely here. Y'all Pisces are like, like finally waking up that's what this is here y'all are finally waking up y'all are interested in changing your story because y'all are realizing that you can change your story here it's like the limitations that you always put yourself under or that you thought you had no longer even feel like limitations to you anymore because it's like what it is that you're desiring matters so much more for you like you guys are just now yeah like pisces y'all are about to be doing something big something major and that makes me so excited for you man so so excited for you all right so let's continue on here you have the three of swords three of cups ace of wands coming in here okay so this is what motivated you pisces you know you you're tired of hurting getting hurt you know it's like in your living environment for some of you guys like it's like maybe like family if you live with family or a roommate or something like that friendship or something it's like you were hurt one last time. You were taken taken for granted one last time. You were disappointed one last time. And that was it for you. That was the straw that broke the camel's back, right? The straw or the feather? The feather that broke the camel's back. Where's the feather coming from, right? It's something like you just had like one, the final straw for you, right? You try to call off from work and your job, your boss is just like, nah, Pisces, I need you to come in regardless, right? And you just realize being like, oh, this energy does not care about me at all, right? It's like you finally woke up, Pisces, and it's like you can't, you can't pretend like you can just go back to what it is that you've been doing. You can't go back to that sense of normalcy, whatever that normal was for you anymore. Like if something is different about you now, Pisces, and I'm so excited for you guys because it's like it's through this where it's like it's motivating you to be more bold you're just like you know what like i don't want to do this job anymore i don't want to live here anymore and so you are hot like other people might describe what you're feeling as manic <laughs> all right because it's just like such an insane change and what's going to be happening for you here pisces but the thing about it is it's like no one understands like where it is that you're coming from like what comes off as manic to other people 
is something that's been like a slow burn for you for quite some time pisces like this has been something that's beating you down for quite some time you like part of the reason why you, some of you guys pisces have been just feeling so depressed so drained you might have been noticing that you've just been sleeping long hours more than normal because it's just like there's just like been this heaviness and so because of everyone else around you pisces because that's the thing i don't feel like anyone else around you pisces not even like your close friends and family realize like how much you've taken on how many burdens you've taken on up until this point so it's just like to the outside world you are just making an irrational decision just out of the heat of the moment but those are just people that don't truly know you for you pisces because you've been taking on these like this reality is like this has been draining of your soul for quite some time now and you just cannot handle it anymore all right and so while you may come off as like the crazy one to everybody else this is the best thing that you could ever be doing for yourself pisces all right you have the nine of swords five of wands with this page of wands coming in here i do see some anxiety here pisces it's like this sense of where your people pleasing aspect is really starting to get to the best of you you know it's like you start out where you pack your bags and you're just like you know what i'm gonna just move to a whole new state i'm gonna move to a whole new country honey all right you pack your bags you're, ha you're about to start that journey and then in your mind you're just like oh no wait a minute i don't want to make these people around me sad by me doing this right your people pleasing aspect becomes your sabotage and your your life again because you're just like because you care so much about how other people are perceiving you and how it'll make other people feel like you don't want to quit that job because you know how hard it's going to be to replace that spot and it's just like pisces i'm gonna have to just be very blunt with you guys here where it's just like you, there's never going to be that perfect time where it's not going to inconvenience somebody and you have to at some point in time just eventually put yourself first you know because reality is it's like you're gonna have like some people are going to just have their hurt feelings some people are going to just miss you pisces but it's like it's not your problem to take on all right you, if you choose to move pisces yeah it might be sad but it's for your betterment it's for the it's what's best for you all right and just because it'll make me sad doesn't mean you need to hold off and living your life living your dreams because it's just like that's just reality sometimes you have to like everyone at some point in time pisces has to accept that you're going to have to you're going to make decisions in your life that inconveniences other people and just because it inconveniences those people doesn't mean that you shouldn't do it all right because if you're not going to do it for yourself then darling what's gonna like it's never gonna happen you're never gonna change your life you're never going to evolve pisces all right so this is having a real honest conversation with you guys here all right because again it's like the very best thing that you could be doing at this time is going like leaning into like what others would perceive as that irrational energy pisces i truly feel that way all right you have the king of swords this is like an affirmation to you right now pisces i feel like you with the king of swords giving this blessing to you your mental health is really like let's not say your mental health is perfect honey <laughs> i feel like i was gonna about to say that and then it's gonna be a pisces be like velka actually your girl is depressed your boy is depressed right? but i feel like the king of swords is more so just giving the blessing and being like no like again like other people think you're being crazy but this is that like you are the you're seeing things the clearest that you have ever seen things like you are like again like you are uh, you're not being manic in this decision this is the best thing for you you're not making a mistake you're not being irrational like do this major change in your life as scary as it might be do this major change you have the page of swords coming in here it keeps on speaking about pisces where it's just like through you doing these changes here six of cups as well both of these cards in the reverse here you know i'm not going to sugarcoat this for you i feel like you're going to deal with a lot of resistances from people in your life from yeah just people in your life that are trying to just keep you um down all right and i don't feel like it's intentional pisces i feel like this these are just people where it's just like their comfort zone for you for their life pisces is you in this small box that they're placing you in which is very limiting for you and so you're naturally going to deal with a little bit of um as i hit my mic you're going to naturally deal with a little bit of friction pisces when you start breaking out of the box that these people put you in 
All right. And so just because you're going like that's something I just really want to prepare you for Pisces, where it's just like, well, with the moment you start breaking out of this mold, this box that everyone else placed you in Pisces, you're going to get a lot of resistance from people that have been part of your life for quite a while. All right. And just because you're getting that resistance, like this is the one thing you don't want to be talked down on Pisces, because I feel like you guys have this is not the first time this has happened for you, Pisces. You've had this experience where it's just like this, the last straw that's happened for you and you're just like you are about to like you're just about to be just done with it all and then these same energies like they're like oh no 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 pisces let's get back in this box here don't get out of this box don't be going crazy now and it's not even a box it's like the sense of like putting you in a straight jacket here pisces where it's just like you're unable to be free you not you're, you it's not even as if you're being treated as like a human with your own passions with your own desires it's just crazy. It's like you need to break the mold here, Pisces. You need to break the confinement, the confinements that other people have placed on you. All right. And the only reason why they've had this much access to you is because you're just such a beautiful, nice person. The moment someone, the moment someone earns your trust and love, Pisces, you are, you will do everything in your power to make them feel nothing but good things. But this is where you have to go against that character, darling Pisces, and make a decision for yourself, even if it makes other people uncomfortable, darling. All right, because it's your life to live. All right, it's your life to be living. They're not going to live it for you. You have the new moon in Leo. Confidence is the key to your success. New moons equaling new beginnings here, Pisces. All right. Confidence is the key to your success. So do not allow those energies that we we're just talking about to instill those seeds of doubt because that's what's going to be happening, Pisces. You're going to start doing these things and they're going to try to instill these seeds of doubt for you. So you start feeling like you're being irrational or crazy or manic or what have you just to try to keep you back into that small box again. You need to be confident with what it is that you're doing this time around. Do not do not back down in your decision decisions at this time all right that's really the biggest mistake that you could be doing for yourself pisces okay and then you have the honeybee card let compassion and forgiveness be your top priority in the situation i feel like what this card is coming in as pisces is like you don't hold it against the people that are in your life right now trying to keep you in that box because in well yes it's very confining for you i don't feel like people see it in that way i feel like people see you in this way where it's just like they just care about you they want to be around you they love you and so they want to have more access to you but this is one of those times where you're just like you know what i love you and i forgive you for trying to limit me right right now but you got to do this for yourself here right it makes me think about that tiktok sound where they're like i gotta put myself first lucius i gotta put myself first that's what i feel like is going on for you all right pisces so i love you so much darling pisces i hope this reading resonates with you in some type of way i hope this gives you the affirmation that you need and know that you have a cheerleader through the screen darling for what it is that you're doing all right pisces so i love you so much darling hopefully you found some cards that resonate with you remember pisces if you want to book a private reading with me uh be sure to go to my website simplyvelka.com all right and be sure to check out my social medias as uh tiktok and instagram both being simply velka same as here and hopefully i can connect with you pisces sometime in the near future darling all right i love you so much pisces and good luck darling bye